What is up, Trainers? Ludo here, back with another fabulous episode of Pokemon Go. And today, I, Ludo Clack, challenge you to a Pokemon battle. It doesn't come out until tomorrow, but I still challenge you. So finally, PVP has been announced in Pokemon Go. As many of you know, over the weekend, Pokemon Go themselves teased us with very weird tweets of uh, very bad resolution pictures and a lot of our opinions of what looked to be, many figured it out with seeing some rings and some uh, uh, blank spots that PVP was coming. And within a couple hours, they'd announced that PVP was coming. And today they finally announced that, could it be coming tomorrow? The tweet totally says basically uh, to get ready go battle, hashtag go battle, but a lot of people are just assuming that it's uh, gonna be a huge information drop, press drop, uh, the, the, the official total announcement. I personally think it's going to drop tomorrow, which would be today, the day you're watching this. And if that's the case, I challenge you to a battle. I mean, I, I do. Eventually, we don't know anything about what it entails yet, whether you have to be friends, uh, you have to use like certain battle passes, if you have to use Stardust or anything, we have no idea. All we do know is that there are currently three different leagues that they are splitting it up into. So first you have the Great League, then you have the Ultra League, and then you have the Master League. Two of these leagues will have uh, competitiveness and a lot of strategy into them because they do have CP limitations. Great League CP limitation is 1500 CP, so anything above that will not be allowed to battle in this, and everything below that can. So that opens up the pool for battling and your choice of Pokemon vastly. Then you have the Ultra League, which is 2,500 CP, and there are there's a lot of Pokemon that fit into that as well, and there is quite a variety as well. So I'm super excited for both of those because those are gonna that's where you're gonna see most of the competitiveness and a majority of your real strategy. Then you have the Master League, which has no CP limit, and that's where you're gonna see your people who just want to you know go all battle out, battle royale you know, three Mewtwo's against three Mewtwo's and see who really is the better person at battling or whatever. So keep in mind, there are a lot of Pokemon and some of them can be level 15 legendaries that could fit into uh, either of these leagues. So keeping a mind on your CP and your Stardust of what you have and what you could power up or, you know, stay away from powering up is, is a lot more crucial of a strategy to use in the game now. From the different posts we have seen, we have gathered many different screenshots and many different pictures have arose, arisen, uh, whatevered online, and there's a lot of hype going on. I myself decided to create my own uh, conceptual idea of what it could be like, given that they do go with this tap tap system, because we haven't seen anything in the data mining or anything hinting towards, unfortunately, a battle rework. So given that we're going with this tap tap, this was the conceptual idea I came up with. And I really love it. I think it actually turned out really great. I had a lot of fun making it. If you think it's fantastic, you should scroll down. Give me that like. <laughs> the teams for these leagues are set up for three Pokemon entries for each. Uh, maybe you might get six like you do in a gym now, but only three slots per league per battle, per team. And who knows if they're adding more battle parties to the party scene where there are three teams that you can auto put into your leagues or if you will have to set those each time. We do know you do have a choice of which league you go into. Uh, beyond that, that's about all we know so far. So the hype is real, especially with their uh, screenshot they showed us today. Totally being nostalgic with that. I mean, if you don't know what it's from, there you go. It, total nostalgic, spot on, nail, hammer, like, wow. So even though there may be many times we're disappointed with Niantic, they really do try very hard to be as authentic as they can while being their own. 
But again, that is all we know. Uh, it's exciting. It's coming soon. A variety of Pokemon are now going to be valuable and uh, viable choices to actually use, power up, and use for uh, move pools and change and whatnot. So get excited. I know when I'm out and about, I'm definitely going to be, uh, if this is what it is, you can just basically battle anybody as long as they're on your friends list or something. But even if there's Wi-Fi battles, that'll be, ooh, if there's Wi-Fi battles. That's a whole nother speculation. Again, we have no idea. All I do know is if our eyes meet, we got some heat. So stay tuned. I will try and find a way to make uh, PVP trainer battles a thing on the channel like its own thing so stay tuned for that exciting things uh i can't wait pvp is finally here it's finally here people but that's it for now please scroll down give me that like maybe consider subscribing if you're not and if you are subscribed be sure to hit the notification button next to the subscription button so that way you're notified of the next adventure and we'll see you then when i challenge you until then stay fabulous bye